YouTube. Today I'm going to be showing you an app. Uh, it only works on Android devices, but it allows you to actually uh, see your high pressure oil pump, pressure, stuff like that. Uh, so this specific one is called Torque. Might be Torque Pro, I can't remember. But uh, you buy the app, it's pretty cheap. You go to, you connect to your Bluetooth device right here. I'll put a link in the description for that. Real time information, and then you wanna add, like you hold down, you add a display to each one here. Okay, so to get all the PIDs for uh, this Ford here, uh, this also works on different vehicles too. You go to settings, settings again, go to manage PID sensors, hit your menu button, add predefined list, and then you're gonna have uh, several here. And this will cover most of your vehicles here. Uh, this gives more specific, more specialized sensors like the high pressure oil pump, so the IPR valve, uh, ICP sensor, stuff like that. So for the power stroke, you click that. I've already imported it, so I'm good there and it just takes a minute. And then after that, you'll have a big list of them and that, that's what it all imported here. So I've got GM and Ford mostly on this. And then we're gonna put real-time information. Okay, so we got the key on. You have to have it on in order for that to work, so leave it on. And then I'm gonna crank it up. This truck has a few issues, so. Okay, so we had good pressure when we were turning it over for the high pressure oil pump, so that's good. There we go. There we go, okay. So this uh, needs a set of injectors. Um, I'm gonna try to get the customer to order a set of eight. Um, but you should always have around 500 or more at idle. So this is struggling to idle a little bit. It's got a little extra higher pressure. Uh, this you should always, it should always be under about 50, 60% at max. Um, here and this is your boost pressure. I actually don't have the turbo hooked up to the engine right now. This is your atmospheric pressure and uh, coolant never seems to read on these for some reason on these models. So you can read your RPMs, your voltage, um, the load. So this is struggling to stay on. That's why I'm low so high. Intake temperature, stuff like that. 